My name is Aisha, I'm in year 13 and I study A-level photography. Uh, my name's Caleb and I'm studying photography A-level. My name's Jack and I'm also studying photography A-level. Um, I guess what I liked about photography was the creative freedom of it all. I needed a creative outlet alongside my other subjects which are pretty essay based. Uh, also, I did study it at GCC level, so that also made it more accessible to me. Uh, probably people. I think having a good teacher and having a good class makes it really fun because uh, you can kind of collaborate on ideas. Um, and also the shoots, especially when we did the, our live project or live reef going out into the park and stuff, doing like nature shoots was really fun. There isn't really structure in the sense that someone's telling you what to do, how to do it. You get to explore the things that you enjoy. Um, however you want, so I think that's what really made me want to do it. I like the opportunities like being able to do trips, even though we haven't been able to do that many, we've been to London and Birmingham and around different exhibits which kind of helps further our project, especially moving into Unit 1 and Unit 2. It brings more fun to the A level. I don't think there is exactly a typical photography lesson, uh, depending on where you are uh, along your coursework, obviously it'll differ as well. Um, when we all walk into class, we're all doing different things. So I might walk into class doing some experimentation, someone else might be doing some work on the computer or might go out do a shoot, that sort of thing. So it isn't really a typical uh, lesson, I would say. We do get a lot of support when we need it. Um, but one of the good things about this subject is it is very independent, it can be very independent, um, especially on Unit 1 and Unit 2, you can pretty much just decide whatever you want to do. Um, but then if you kind of need to figure something out, there's always, you can ask your peers, um, it's just quite easy to just turn to someone and be like, oh, can you help me out with this? Uh, or a teacher, obviously, uh, will always help, giving tutorials on like Photoshop and Lightroom to help achieve what you want. Well, obviously my own teacher is pretty helpful. She helps a structure, you know, when I need to do things, outline deadlines, that sort of thing. But also, uh, just because they don't teach me, other teachers help out as well, like Rebecca and Pam. Uh, oftentimes when I ask one teacher for something, they'll be like, oh, well, so-and-so can help you out with it. So there is actually quite a lot of support. We've also had people come in from outside to do like, as you said, like Lightroom tutorials and other things, different like exhibits that kind of help, not like directly help, but help us further anything really to do with our work. Loads, so much. Yeah. Uh, it's the sort of subject that will have you working all night, every yeah. night, but in a good way, because it's photography, so you'll enjoy it. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's, it's, it is enjoyable. Like sometimes if you haven't done a page in lesson, you've kind of got to go home and actually finish the page because the last thing you want is stressing as we have at the end of unit one because you haven't finished it all. Yeah. So you've got to get it done as soon as you can. Just stop, say, like no, really stop off. procrastinating it really. Just get it done and it will, it will be a lot easier in the end. But again, it's yeah. photography. So if you enjoy photography, it'll feel like work. Yeah, definitely. I would say don't let not having as much experience with the photography um, stop you because I know a lot of people think I haven't studied it at GCC therefore I can't do it but in reality I think it's quite an uh, easy subject to sort of get the hang of uh, then also stay on top of your work I would say it's coursework based there are lots of deadlines so if you fall behind it will have lots of repercussions yeah definitely yeah, do, do it, it. Um, it's been my favourite A-level mm -hmm. without a doubt it's an A-level that you kind of look forward to isn't oh, it oh absolutely like, when you, you're in, you come into a lesson you're like I'm kind of glad it's photography even though it is an A-level it's kind of something that you are looking forward to at the end of the day especially like, on a Friday it's our last lesson it's it's good yeah absolutely plus it's not nothing that it is difficult but in like it's own way that you can make it easy the more work you do the more time you put in the more effort you do yeah it's only as difficult as you learn it yeah you can't sure. so if you just keep on top of it I think it's really fun but yeah definitely do it if you want it if you want to do it do it